Hi, this is Supreet, and today we're gonna see how to create our own chat GPT, right? So uh, the solution uh, contains uh, usage of .NET framework and uh, an API endpoint, right? So the API endpoint uh, you can get it from OpenAI uh, website, wherein you can have uh, API reference documents and then generate your API key. Uh, once you generate the API key uh, from the OpenAI site, uh, you just have to um, you know, come back to your uh, .NET framework solution, uh, wherein you have to use HTTP client. Uh, once you inject HTTP client um, uh, classes, uh, you will have to key in the endpoint. This is the endpoint. <clears throat> and then uh, you will have to key in your api key uh, wherein i have set that key as a part of header over here and then you just have to um, you know provide uh, an input parameter or an input prompt wherein this is the input prompt that i've provided uh, and then you will have to use http, HTTP client um, uh, methods uh, wherein I've used HTTP client dot post uh, where you have to pass all the request parameters and then get a response to it. So pretty straightforward and simple. So let's see how it works. This is a simple web API solution uh, wherein <clears throat> you create a web API project, uh, have controllers, uh, have uh, you know, uh, put method or post method uh and then uh write your business logic over here uh this can be of course refactored uh, but just for the demo purpose um, i've kept the business logic in the controller itself now once you run the solution uh you will have a swagger interface like this so once i say post post will ask for the input parameters so let me ask you this is your query to chat gpt so uh, and I say, uh, let's let's key in some queries. So this should give a response. Now, if you look at the response, um, you can see uh, over here. There's a text field under the choices array. Uh, this is your answer. Right, so let me ask some other technical questions to this. Let me remove this breakpoint execute and say seven mm, but i don't think so this is a, a correct answer probably let me execute again and see this now says is eight <clears throat> but i believe we have much higher version angular 17 i believe um, i'm sorry 15. Um, let me ask a few more questions Okay, it says there's no one size fit, fit all answer to this question. Let me modify my question. Okay, it just says download the React source code from the official website. Uh